very early. But I love doing these, so I get up early just to do them. Um, how would you feel if you could make four days of meals in under an hour? Or maybe you could take that date night with hubby that you haven't had in forever. This is kind of what the time management series is going to help you do. It's going to help you find out, uh, add in those activities that you never thought you'd be able to do into your schedule, while also getting more accomplished in a day. Um, today I'm actually going to uh, show you how to get your priorities straight. Uh, the biggest thing I, I wanted to tell you guys about today is I have a freebie for you. It is actually um, a schedule. Uh, download that you can get it. I'll put it in the link um, in, in the replay post of this video uh, for anyone that's watching live and uh, anyone that's just getting on now or later uh, you'll see a link um, below for the schedule. It's actually the same one I use. I use it in a digital a digital format so uh, I'll, later on maybe I'll, sh I'll do like a recorded video and show you how, how I use that. I use Google Calendar and I love it, and I have um, alerts set up in it and everything, so I, I can stay on task during the day. Um, so what do you have to do today is, is the first thing, because we're going to get our priorities straight. Um, what are the necessary things you do? Like, you, you have to get this done. Someone will be malnourished, <laughs> hurt, possibly die. L those are the things that, like, those are necessi the necessity activities. What I want you to do is grab a piece of paper and pen, and I want you to... Um, write them all down. That's how I first got started. I wrote down what I had to do every day, um, made a list of that, of that, or in a week, we'll just say. Um, what after that, I want you to write down the days that you have to do these things, have to do, be do, um, done by, and how much time it will take to do each one of them. So next to each list each activity, and then after you're done listing all of them, list what day they're they're due on, and then how long it'll take to do it. Like for instance, on Tuesdays my son has soccer practice, so I have to pick him up later that day. So I write down Tuesdays, 3:30. I have to pick him up from school. Or for instance, these lives, 3:30, 4 in the morning. Every day, I have that time. Um, blocked out to do these lives. Now once that's done, I want you to write down all the activities that you've wanted to do but never had time to do. That is the one, this is where it's going to get fun because basically I'm going to show you how you can fit um, things into your schedule. You're going to notice when you list those activities, print out the schedule and download it, load it when we're done. Um, you're going to list all those activities and the and times and days that they're all due on. And you're going to notice empty pockets of time. And that's where we're going to try to fit in these uh, things we want to do to get through our day. And the things that will help us de-stress and uh, reach goals if we have goals. And be more productive, basically. Because we all need to, we're all, we're all working we're all going to be working really hard getting everything done every day and you're going to, we all need to decompress and, and get away from that otherwise you're just going to be stressed and anxious all the time um, we're going to get into like actually filling in those things and picking those activities that we really want to do we're going to, we're going to figure that out tomorrow but for now I just want you to list it and uh, I hope you catch the replay and download the schedule because it's actually going to be very useful to use because it's the exact same one I'd use so that'd be useful to go off the same one um, I hope you enjoyed this. Don't forget to leave what's your one activity that you really want to do in the comments because I want to hear it. Uh, I'll talk to you tomorrow morning. Remember, discover your power today.